Peter Wants Pixar's Toy Story 4 to get rid of Bo Peep's Crook Animal Rights Group Peter Wants Pixar's upcoming to get rid of Bo Peep's Crook. Voiced by Annie Potts, the character was noticeably absent from Toy Story 3, but after 20 years of not being an active part of the Toy Story family, Bo Peep is set to return in, complete with a new look. Long portrayed as the love interest of the Tom Hanks voiced character Woody, Bo Peep's presence in Toy Story has always been subtle and sweet. And while she does not necessarily occupy the same amount of screen time as Woody, Buzz Lightyear, or even characters like Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head, the character has always been a recognizable part of the Toy Story series and far from a controversial element in any way. All of that is perhaps about to change, however, as Bo Peep has suddenly been thrust into the limelight. Peter has released a statement addressing their desire to have Bo Peep's Shepherd's Crook removed from the final cutoff. With Pixar's modern reworking of Bo Peep's look in the latest film, Peter has asked director Josh Cooley to make additional changes. The request specifically addresses the fact that Bo Peep's new look is meant to appear modern, though Peter argues that the crook is outdated and cruel. Peter's manager of animals in film and television Lauren the Masson said, I'm contacting you today about Bo Peep's new look. Given that she was designed to have a modern look, why H-A-S-N-T she lost that outdated and cruel crook? You may not know that these shepherd's crooks are used solely to hook a sheep's neck and force these gentle animals to move. That I-S-N-T something that a progressive Bo Peep would countenance in 2019, a bardus Bo Peep would likely bop the shearers, not the sheep. A symbol of domination over any animal is a thing of the past and not something that belongs in. Won't you please consider removing Bo Peep's crook from the final animation? The crook is a tool traditionally used by shepherds and those in the wool industry to hook sheep by the legs and neck in order to facilitate their control. In their appeal to Pixar and Cooley, Peter pointed out that 11 out of 99 sheep operations on four different continents have been caught abusing and torturing sheep even going as far as to skin them alive or for their wool. Peter is known for their tough stunts on animal rights and has even succeeded bringing change to various production methods for corporations and organizations like Nike, NASA and high-end fashion retailer Cash to name but a few. Their past efforts are end typically directed at animated films, but in 2019 it appears that Peter is intent on taking the fight for the respect of animals to a new level. As of this writing, neither Pixar nor Cooley has responded to the request, but it should be acknowledged that this ISNT is something to be taken lightly. Over the years, Peter has proven themselves to be an organization with a great deal of power and sway over public opinion. Whether or not you agree with Peter's tactics or even their claim that Bo Peep's crook is morally disagreeable, it's clear that the last thing Pixar needs in the lead up to this summer's release is to be at the center of a controversy that could potentially harm box office receipts. Source Peter